Breaking news tonight in the Gulf. Millions of gallons of oil are spilling. The Deepwater Horizon is sinking. This was the worst accidental oil spill ever in the history of the world. An oil spill stretching for miles. So I'm from Alabama. My family used to take vacations down on the Gulf Coast. It's a really special place to me. My name is David Murphy, and I study oil spills. There's just lots of things that are coated with oil. The Deepwater Horizon event. It's really just a terrible, terrible tragedy. We want to better understand what happens when there is an oil spill and what we can do next time to better clean up after it. This is the Oil Spill Laboratory here in the Whiting School of Engineering at Johns Hopkins University. How close are we there, Cheng? Here we study what happens when oil is released into the natural environment, and we study how that oil spreads out and disperses. So today we did a demonstration kind of replicating the blowout on the bottom of the ocean. We can inject large amounts of crude oil. We take high-speed video, and from that we can look at things like the plume behavior. Uh, so we have an oil plume rising in water. Uh, how quickly does it rise? The oil will break up into droplets. We want to know the, uh, the size distribution of those droplets. The more small droplets we have, the more the tiny microorganisms can then attack those little oil droplets, so then they can break it down more easily. You can see a lot of small droplets. Once we understand the physics, we can then feed that information into models that will help us predict where the oil will go when there is another spill. I care greatly about my home state, and so I'm glad to be working on research that really affects people. It's nice to know that what we're doing is, is in the end, going to help people.